Yeah, it's a dead zone currently. Nothing is happening here. It's just a skeletal building. And nothing really is happening here. So, I don't so, know. Okay, you don't know. So you have a lot of a lot of Do you know how many years it's been here? Hi, people. This is Urbanized Media. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and turn on bell notification so that anytime I post a new video, you get notified. So, my people, can you guess where we are right now? I hope you can. Some of you can guess. Looking at the background, well, we are here in Umuchuku in Anambra State. Umuchuku is a town that has the famous 17-story building that should be a medical research center. So we are here to bring you the update about this project, what is happening, and why this project is yet to start functioning, even after so many years of, you know, the pictures trending online and people being optimistic about the project. So come with me, let's go. And we have someone here with us. So guys, and um, we are here with um, Ada Orumba. So um, she invited me to her town. This is actually her town. The next town is her town. So they are having, they are celebrating the New Year Festival. So we are using this opportunity to explore and bring you update about this project. So as that, um, say hi to my viewers. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so um, just them. Um, so we are in your town. We want to know about this um, 17 story building, this medical research center. Can you, you know, tell us what about this project? People out there, they want to know what's happening here. Sadly, I need to correct an impression. I'm not from Umutufu. I'm rather from the neighboring town. Okay, actually, this is my neighboring village. Mm. And um, this structure has been here for a while. Um, the structure was built by Dr. Maduka, a one-time gubernatorial candidate of Anambra State. Uh, he built this research center um so few years back and uh, from what i know he sent uh, he handed over this structure to anambra state government that was the last information i had about this place he handed the structure over to anambra state and I, I i remember i recall that at a point they said they brought some part of uh they brought some departments from anambra state uh, anambra state university to here but Actually, it's okay, a dead to, zone. to start making use of this place. Yeah, it's a dead zone currently. Nothing is happening here. It's just a skeletal building. And nothing really is happening here. Oh, it's quite sad. It's quite sad. Coming and, you know, imagine the, the amount of money that I've wasted. Let's say wasted. We are still optimistic because it might still start functioning tomorrow. But, you know, this kind of project, after spending all this money, we are expecting that something should be happening by now. So, but do you have, tell us what's happening, why is it not functioning? Like, like I said, the structure has been here over years, you know, it's more of a, th a tourist site than a medical research institute, do you get? It's been here for a while. Oh, the, so the works actually were there, they finish it again. Okay. Yes. But I, I, I tell you, no one now, Anambra State Government, we, um, the doctor, we was in this some part of Anambra State uh, Anambra State University, some department that had the ever for research institute. I remember no when when you're in a news or something. I don't know. Okay, you don't know. So you have a lot of a lot of Do you know how many years it's been here? You can you recollect how many years the structure there ever? I can't remember. Because oh. I was not at home the time where they started it. Oh, okay. 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 So, um, Ada has um, interviewed one of the villagers um, mm -hmm. concerning the reason why this place is here to start functioning. So, we are looking to know if we are going to see another person so that they can still tell us because we are so concerned about this project. It's sad that something this big, this massive, is actually lying away here in Orumba. It's really sad. I hope if it's, the, if it's Adam Brasley uh, government that is the cause, that they should come very fast and start making use of the, the project. Well, I don't think it's Anambra State government that is the cause because even the internal work is yet to be completed. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you can see that. You see, the this place seems to be the entrance to the to the hospital.
So we are taking a 360 tour of the building. Everywhere is now overgrown with bush. is actually massive. If you really start walking here. Eh? Very good parking lot. Has a very expensive but doesn't have a kind of perimeter fencing. Mm. No perimeter fencing. Okay, here seems to be another entrance. Yeah. I think it has underground parking lots. Yeah, it seems like. Oh. This place needs to start functioning. Whatever, whatever is the reason, it. whatever is the reason why this place is here to start functioning, like they need to be, they need to fix it. If it's from the government, if it's from the owner, whoever is delaying this project from kicking off, like you guys should, you know, have your thing. It's becoming more of a tourist site than an actual. A research institute is becoming more of a tourist site. During the Xmas season, you see people coming here to take pictures, and it's not supposed to. It's not supposed to be so. This is, a waste, this is an infrastructure we're in, wasting away here in Omochiko. Government, if the cause of this, please, please, it's time you wake up and start using the project. <laughs> 